Hey everybody, it's me Vic. So I'm kind of excited to get back to work on content in regards to YouTube and I figured why not start with after experiencing some technical difficulties doing a BIOS update and uh, having to completely reinstall everything. Um, what better way than to post in multiple discords, multiple messages, um, but with one text file. And uh, I'm kind of excited because I know everybody has been asking, can I just edit one message and it does it for me in all of them? Well, now you can. And that is thanks to Bar Radar's plugin. So we're gonna get started here. And uh, let's see. I know I know y'all are seeing everything that's on the Stream Deck software. So I'm gonna point out that this software version is 6.1.0.18521. The reason why I'm doing this is because this video is being made on March 19th, 2023. And so this is only for current in the moment, because as you are aware, when it comes to technology, everything is ever changing. So if you are going to be in the future watching this video and you're looking back six months later or whatever, and you're upset that it's not with current standards, keep in mind this video is being made for what's happening here and now, not future proof. Um, things may change in the future. That's the way of technology, ever adapting. So get with the program <laughs> anyways, and learn to adapt. All right, so here we go. Um, we are gonna talk about Discord, right? So I'm gonna jump to my Discord profile here. I already got one set up, and then primarily this is what it's gonna look like. But uh, before we get there, we've gotta look for a couple of things. So we're gonna go to the Stream Deck uh, plugin store here, and we're gonna go to plugins. If you type in Bar Raider, I mean, you can click on whatever pl uh, plugin and it'll pull it up when you click on Bar Raider indirectly. And what you're gonna want to download is, I'm looking for it. It is the text file tools. So if you type in text file tools or you just type in Bar Raider and you click on whatever plugin and you say, uh, click on Buy Bar Raider, you'll be able to come to the text file tools. This is what you need to post one message across multiple servers. Now, here's what we're gonna do. I have a blank template right here, and the reason why I kind of already have the multi-action set up, and it is a multi-action, but the reason why I already have this set up is because I have already configured the app to open up, um, and respectively, it's gonna be matching whatever your personal folder is on your Windows. So, uh, you know, I can probably post that, and I'll put like your name or your file or something in the description later. Well, let's get started here. So here's basically our template. We're gonna go to a multi-action. So if you don't know where multi-action is, you are gonna go to here and you're gonna select multi-action and then drag it and it'll bring you to the same place. I already have this created, so we're gonna go here. And I put questions because I am gonna talk about posting <laughs> um, how to do this. That, that's why it says question mark, okay? I have one that's a random question generator for question of the day, but that's entirely different and that's not what we're gonna focus on. So I have limited what I show under the text file tools. And as you can see right here, these are going to be um, the only two options that I use. All the other ones you can actually hide. So if you click here, and you, uh, you've already installed the plugin, you're gonna see you can uncheck each individual. That way you don't need them. Um, that way, when you uncheck them, you only have the ones that are checked that you need. And I felt that it's easier as far as, um, I wanna say navigation for me, because there are so many options on Stream Deck. And I like to use the things that I want to use and not the extras that I don't use. Um, so less clutter on my desktop is the way that I see it. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do, right, we're gonna open up Discord. Now, if your Discord is already open and you just wanna actually just post the message, you can do that. But personally, I like to push the button and it opens up Discord for me. It goes to whatever area I need it to via channel um, or server and then channel, and it will do that for me. Now, I wait for Discord to load, so I give it about five seconds. And so that's what I'm gonna call this. So we're gonna label it five seconds and we're gonna be doing a lot of copying and pasting, um, mainly because there's only one thing that we're gonna need, right? So here we're gonna select Discord and then we're gonna go to our text channel 
And in this case, I'm using my personal server. I think I'll probably pop in one for Elgato under general and, you know, put some kind of pleasant message. I hope everybody's doing well or I hope your day is going well or something. But uh, we're going to go to mine and we're going to select general. And then what we're going to do is select next line writer. And then what we're going to also make sure is that when we put this in here for the text file tools from Bar Raider, we're going to simulate enter as a, a string. And the reason why is because we want to make sure that when we're posting the message, it hits enter to post the message in that channel. All right. So from here, we are going to go to notepad. Actually, I've already created one. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. So this one is going to say testing, right? So I'm basically telling my server ahead of time, testing out, posting a message in multiple Discord channels. I'll be using my own server versus other servers. So heads up, it's not spam. It comes up. Um, but we're going to do that, right? <laughs> so I'm going to basically spam my general channel. Keep in mind, this may not be in terms of service with Discord. Um, so use at your own risk. All righty. And then, and that's it's why I'm only using my server as the guinea pig right now. The next channel I'm going to do is foodies and uh, we're going to basically copy and paste. Now in between these, I still want to give a window of five seconds. So I'm going to move this here. Oh, we already have it copied and then here. So I'm going to do one more channel of mine and I am going to put this in, I don't know. Uh, you know what? We're going to avoid the mod channel. Uh, that I prefer to just keep that between me and the mods, but we'll we'll post it in um I don't know we'll, we'll spam the feature streamers. <laughs> well, we'll do it. I'm I'm up for a little bit of fun shenanigans, and they're just gonna be like, "What?" I don't think we need to do that. All right. So now that we've done it, right? We're gonna pull up our Discord here. Here's my Discord, and I am gonna post everything to my discord right now and you all are going to see that happen real time oh i'm probably on it here huh oh i should probably turn myself off of the camera for a second but as you see it's going to each channel and it's posting the message and i will show you um let me go ahead and turn off my camera now so it's telling them testing out, posting a message. So we went to general. Oh, it double posted here in general. <laughs> it was supposed to post it in foodies. Um, and then in, of course, in the featured streamers. And it did just that. So we're going to delete the message. We're going to delete the messages again. And I'm going to show you real time again how that works, right? So I'm going to push the button here and oh, you all can't see that, can y'all? That's okay. Hold on, y'all. There we go. Now you're going to see me push the button. This whole time I've been like putting my hand over the stream deck and I realized the stream deck wasn't on. So we're going to, we're going to do that one more time. And I just need to get to it real quick here. Here we go. So I'm going to push the question uh, button here. And you're just going to watch it post in multiple channels on my server. And this is why I give it five seconds. And it posts in every channel that I wanted it to. So the other cool thing, right, I'm going to delete these because I don't want my, my server, my, my people on my server being like, what is going on here, right? Um, and then I'm going to edit the message and then repost. And the message is going to say success. So I have a messages folder just for this purpose. And as you can see, this was my message, right? So now I'm going to put here success. And then we're gonna save. Now I don't have to change anything here because I changed it in the message. Here we go. And we're gonna do it one more time. 
Now it may take a moment. I only edited one message. I didn't have to go in there and do it multiple times, just once. And that's thanks to this amazing plugin made by Bar Reader. I hope, uh, I hope you all are going to be enjoying using this to make things a lot simpler in Discord. I know it's made it simple for me. And uh, because of that, I am really excited to show you this amazing new way of posting in multiple servers, multiple channels, and editing one message. Anyways, thanks for watching, y'all. Have a wonderful rest of your day.